Good afternoon. I'm so proud of the team who've now vaccinated 9.2 million people across the UK. That includes 931,204 vaccinations just this weekend. And to put that into context, that's one in every 60 adults in the whole United Kingdom vaccinated in one single weekend. I'm delighted that I can tell you that we have visited every eligible care home with older residents in England and offered vaccinations to all of their residents and staff. It is about protecting those who are most vulnerable to COVID. We've now vaccinated almost 9 in 10 of all over 80s in the UK. And now, as of today, we've vaccinated over half of all people in their 70s. And I'm delighted that I can tell you that we have visited every eligible care home with older residents in England and offered vaccinations to all of their residents and staff all across the United Kingdom. And the vaccine programme just goes to show how important it is, the whole UK working as one together. Today, we've ordered another 40 million vaccine doses from Valneva. As we have all along, we've invested early and at risk before we know for sure if it'll come good. Because from the start, we've taken a no regrets attitude to backing vaccines. We've tried to leave nothing on the table. If this gets regulatory approval, the Valneva vaccine, like many others, will be made right here in the UK. Supply. Today, we've ordered another 40 million vaccine doses from Valneva. As we have all along, we've invested early and at risk. Our South African colleagues spotted a new variant through their high quality genomic sequencing and rightly notified the world as we did with the variant that we discovered here in the UK. We've now identified 105 cases of this variant here. 11 of those cases don't appear to have any links to international travel. There's currently no evidence to suggest this variant is any more severe, but we need to come down on it hard, and we will. We've already made sure that all these cases are isolating and that we've done enhanced contact tracing of all of their close contacts. We're surging extra testing into the areas where this variant has been found and sequencing every single positive case. Working with local authorities, we're going door to door to test people in the local area. Rollout is a global effort. One of the many reasons that I'm so happy with the AstraZeneca contract is that it not just gives us a strong